This was truly a team effort, and there is no team quite like Team Tahoe. The coalition that made today possible spans a tremendous diversity of backgrounds, jurisdictions, and viewpoints. Yet we have all come together around the goal of protecting something that is larger than any of us, that transcends political differences, that is timeless. In this way, the Lake Tahoe Restoration Act and the extraordinary coalition behind it have become a national model for collaboration in the name of conservation. It's a really incredible privilege to be here today because I have spent my entire adult life in this basin, working on issues throughout the region, trying to protect the, the lake, encourage recreation in a safe and healthy manner, and looking at the beauty of this lake, its history and vitality, uh, making sure that we protect it into the future. We gather today in gratitude in immense gratitude to our congressmen and our U.S. Senator that are here and the entire congressional uh, group that put this together and, and have moved us forward. Congressman Kiley came into office and really moved this forward, including nearly $6 million in additional projects for the basin, including the critical water infrastructure resources for first responders, affordable housing, and other uh, equipment for our first responders. The Lake Tahoe Restoration Act will help us address the biggest environmental challenges that we face. I want to start off by, as well, thanking a great partner, Congressman Kevin Kiley, um, not only for bringing us together today to celebrate this exciting milestone, but the incredible work that he did in getting it through the House. I didn't know if you remember when we were here for Tahoe Summit, the Tahoe Summit, uh, we were basically challenging him, saying, we got it through the Senate. Now you got to get it through the House. What are you going to do? And he said that day, I'm going to get it done. And he went back to Congress and he texted me every step of the way and said, here's what we're doing and here's how we're doing it. And this is the next step. And damned if he didn't get it done. It is about all of us who love this lake continuing to work together at all levels to make sure we can continue to support it, promote it, protect it for future use as well. And that's what it's about. So I, I thank you, you're a great partner and I look forward to working with you in the future as well. We had to carry out this essential work to keep Tahoe blue. With the Environmental Improvement Program and the Lake Tahoe Restoration Act, Tahoe became a national priority. It's a place worth protecting and that became evident. Standing here, looking out over this pristine water of Lake Tahoe, we are reminded of the incredible responsibility and privilege that we have to protect this national treasure. The work that we do here is challenging beyond measure. But as we stand in this incredible place with its crystal clear waters and majestic peaks surrounding us, the work is worth the effort. Lake Tahoe deserves nothing less. I just want to say uh, there are so many people here who work so hard uh, on a daily basis and we have so much work to do to actually secure the funding for priority projects and get them appointed. But I think today is a great opportunity uh, to just uh, pause, to celebrate, to reflect on all that we've accomplished and to be reminded of all that we're fighting for.